Happy Vlogmas Day 22, my friends. So I was going to film like this whole like DIY with stained glass ornaments, but it didn't turn out very well, so I decided I don't want to do that. So we're going to talk about Christmas movies instead. So I will say immediately that tomorrow's Vlogmas is going to be late because we had to go, we have to, we have to leave here pretty soon, go out of town rather unexpectedly. And so Shane and I have to do our Christmas tomorrow night instead of tonight like we were going to do. So the Vlogmas tomorrow will be our Christmas, but it will be up a little late because Shane doesn't get off till 6 and I won't be back until, until town until later in the afternoon. So, yeah, but I wanted to talk about Christmas movies because every October um, we do the 31 Days of Horror where we watch a horror movie every day of October. And this month we've almost pretty much been watching a Christmas movie every day of December and it's been amazing. Like if you want to get in and like stay in the Christmas spirit, watch a Christmas movie like every day. It's amazing. <laughs> But we've been watching some new Christmas movies that we've never seen before and some old classics such as Home Alone, a classic for Shayna and Matt, but I had never seen it. And I freaking loved it because one, I didn't know it was written and produced by John Hughes. I did not know it was directed by Chris Columbus and the score is by John Williams. So it's like, <laughs> I mean, it's like two thirds Harry Potter and one third awesomeness, the awesomeness that is John Hughes. Um, but I loved Home Alone. It was way funnier than I was expecting. And then last night, two nights ago, we watched Home Alone 2, um, which of course wasn't as good. It was like a pretty much a carbon copy of Home Alone. It was almost like watching The Force Awakens and having spent your whole life watching A New Hope. Um, but... <laughs> Only a lot less anger. But we've watched Better Off Dead, which of course is a classic, and you might not consider it a Christmas movie. Like when you think about it, you might not be like, oh, great Christmas movie. But technically, it kind of is. We haven't watched Gremlins yet, because that's technically a Christmas movie in Iron Man 3. Um, but we did watch, we went to the theater and we watched Office Christmas Party, which was pretty funny. There's a couple areas where, like, I think people were underutilized and some people were way overused. Um, but we also, last, mm, not last Christmas, because it came out last Christmas, but in the summer, in the summertime we bought The Night Before, which of course is like Joseph Gordon-Levitt and, um, Falcon. <laughs> Seth Rogen, oh God, I could not think of his name, and Anthony Mackie, Falcon, and we watched that, and it is a weird movie, but it's really funny. I actually watched that while I was wrapping. We watched that while I was wrapping, like, all our family Christmas presents, so it was, like, a really good way to, like, yeah, I'm wrapping presents because it's Christmas. Um, we watched, of course, Ghosts of Girlfriends Past that one night you saw while we watched Home Alone. Um, uh, Matt finally got me to watch The Santa Claus, which, holy crap, I did not realize that movie was that old, but it, it really is, it's that old, and, um, like, the effects do not hold up, it's pretty horrible effects, but the movie itself is pretty funny, like, it has some pretty funny moments. Um, I definitely enjoyed it a lot more than I expected. Shayna has always raved about that movie, and I was just like, <laughs> dork. But actually, it's pretty funny in places. So, yeah, I've gotten to watch a lot of Christmas movies this Christmas I've never seen before. So, <sighs> but on our to watch list in the next three days, oh my god, um, we have to watch Elf. Because you have to watch Elf. Uh, um, plus, we went to the Rush game last night. And since it was a couple nights before Christmas, they were playing like a lot of clips from Elf between plays. Um, but we have to watch White Christmas. 
And there's one more. Oh, I am making Matt watch I'll Be Home for Christmas with Jonathan Taylor Thomas, like from way back in the day, because that movie is freaking hilarious and he's never seen it. So I'm making him watch it this Christmas. So anyway, I think that'll do it for Vlogmas Day 22, talking about Christmas movies. I love you guys so much. I'm sorry my DIY fell through, but it was just not good. Just you didn't want to see it anyway. Um, I don't know what I did wrong, but it did not turn out like it was supposed to. So, all right, I will see you guys tomorrow night. We're going to be opening presents. I'm so excited. <sighs> Shayna is really confident about what she got me this year, so I'm really eager to see what it is. Alright, I love you guys so much, and I will see you tomorrow.